Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to walk you through exactly how to print from Canva step by step. By the end of this tutorial you'll know how to create a design with your own custom size, make it look fantastic with a template, and save it in the best format for printing so your final product comes out looking crisp and professional. Whether you need to print invitations, flyers, stickers, or anything else, this guide is for you, so let's jump right in and get started. First things first, head over to Canva. If you don't already have an account, don't worry, signing up is quick and free and it'll let you access all the design tools you'll need. Once you're in, look for the big Create a Design button. It's usually right near the top of the homepage, hard to miss. Click on that and you'll see an option for custom size. This is where Canva really shines because it lets you make something that fits your exact needs instead of being locked into a preset template. Now we want to set our custom size. For this example, we're going to use 100 by 50. That's most likely in pixels by default, but you can easily change the unit to inches or millimeters depending on what your project requires. If you're planning to print, I always recommend selecting inches or millimeters to match what your printer or print shop will need, just so there are no surprises with scaling later on. So type in 100 for the width and 50 for the height, double check you've got the right measurement units, and then hit Create New Design. Canva will open up a blank canvas for you, perfectly sized for your project. Now for the fun part, adding a template. If you're not sure where to start, templates are a fantastic shortcut. They give you a fully designed layout that you can customize with your own text, colors, and images. Just look to the left panel and you'll see a whole menu of templates tailored for all sorts of occasions, business cards, invitations, labels, you name it. Find one that matches your vision, click to add it, and in just a second it'll appear on your canvas. You can now personalize it as much as you like, change the fonts, move things around, add your own images, or keep the design just as it is. Alright, once you're happy with your design, it's time to save it for printing. Look for the share button in the upper right corner, then choose the download option. This is where a lot of people get tripped up, but don't worry, just select PDF print from the download options. This format is the best choice for printing because it preserves all those fine details and color quality, so your printout will look crisp and vibrant, not blurry or washed out. If you see options for crop marks or bleed, you can enable those if your print shop requests it. Give it a moment to download larger files or complex designs might take a few seconds. Once it's ready, you'll find the file in your downloads folder. From here, you can open it up and send it straight to your printer or email it to a local print shop if you want that extra professional touch. And that's really all there is to it. You've just created a custom design, made it print ready, and saved it in the best possible format for gorgeous, high-quality results. If you found this walkthrough helpful, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. And if you have any questions about Canva or printing, just drop a comment below. I respond to every single one. Be sure to subscribe for more easy, practical tutorials like this. Thanks for watching and happy designing.